Ben Bratton is an unlikely champion of an unlikely sport. A standout member of the U.S. fencing team that just won America's first gold medal in fencing's world championship in Kiev, Ukraine, he's the first African American and youngest American ever to win a team gold. It's a great feeling to be at the forefront of something like that, and I think it's a great symbol of like progression, like how far we've come that someone like me can break in and race wouldn't impede my success. He picked up his first sword in Queens, New York when he was 10 years old, part of a program bringing the unique sport to inner city kids. You were never bullied because you were a fencer? I mean, when you have a sword, it's very hard to be bullied. So, uh, <laughs> so I, I, don't, I never had trouble in that regard. What a thrilling finish there. Ben's hard work and skill earned him high school and college scholarships, his gold medal, and maybe in four years, a trip to the Olympics. You don't look at all scared about fencing me. I'm not. Ben agreed to give me a shot at the title. Well, <laughs> at least a chance to score a point or two. Ready? Yes. You ain't got nothing, man. Oh. In real competitions, Ben's often the only African American. He says it adds pressure and makes him a target, but also pushes him to excel, earning comparisons to groundbreakers like Jackie Robinson, Arthur Ashe, and Tiger Woods. At the end of the day, if I'm compared to to those great African-American, you know, pioneers for their sport, then that's fine, but I still have too much work to do to kind of get caught up in that. It's too soon? It's way too soon. Uh, it's here. Ben coaches kids during the day and is looking for sponsors to help him stay on top. In New York, Rick Leventhal.